Hey y'all, I'm about to make a spicy, creamy avocado zoodle salad. Okay, so I've already cut up most of the ingredients. So what I used here is three avocados. Everything is already in the Nutribullet ready to go. So this would be short and sweet. Um, three avocados, tablespoon of grapeseed oil, but you can use um, avocado oil. Do not use um, coconut oil because coconut oil this is a cold salad so coconut oil you know hardens up you don't want that you want it to be creamy um, and you're gonna use a juice for one large lime uh, a tablespoon of um, sea salt uh, like a small handful of cilantro basically you're, you're blending up some guacamole with a couple of other things I put three cloves of garlic because I like my stuff garlicky I put a half of a jalapeno pepper and a half of a jalapeno pepper so um, we're gonna blend this in uh, together in the Nutribullet so it can be creamy so we'll do that now requires onion just about this much onion like like uh, three quarter one quarter of an onion not quite a half half of a half okay and if it becomes a little hard to blend, you're just gonna add just a little bit of water, but not much, because you don't you want it to be more creamy than watery. Okay. perfect cream the perfect cream all right so now that I have that made I am going to I already have my zoodles so I used two um, zucchini and two squash so we got yellow I like my food colorful so and then I like the taste of the green and the yellow as well I have two of each so I'm gonna add a fifth one and I'm going to show you, in case you're not familiar with how to make your own zoodles. This is a zoodle machine. And you just put it in here and zoodle it up. Or you can just buy a bag of zoodles at the store. You can do that too. But we have time on our hands right now. We can make some zoodles, okay? <laughs> more affordable, not packaged, and it's kind of fun. So here are your zoodles. I mean, you can make spaghetti and everything with this, okay? If you're on a carb-free lifestyle. Um, I cut my zoodles up. Because, uh, you know, we're not eating spaghetti here. We're it's a creamy zoodle salad. So we want the bite to be clean. All right. So now, did I tell y'all put a tablespoon of grapeseed oil in there? Oh yeah, I did. Okay. Okay. So now we're gonna mix it up. And it's almost ready. So you just spoon it out. Mm. 
Mix it up. Mix it up nice and thorough. You might have some left. If you have some left, you can make some like avocado toast with it. Heck, you can even put this on top of avocado toast. Mm -hmm. But I think this is going to be just enough. Because it's creamy zoodle, avocado zoodles. And the key word is creamy. Mm. Okay. So we mix that up. So before I top it off, I'm going to taste it just to make sure it doesn't need anything else. I'm sure it doesn't because I've made this so many times. I could make this in my sleep. So, mm. <laughs> I ain't gonna say that. I ain't gonna say nothing. Wow. Okay. All right. Just think it needs to be. I measured it. Okay. I'm getting a little better with reciting my measurements here because usually I just put a pinch of this and a pinch of that but people continue to ask me for the recipe so I'm like all right let me let me get a little bit grown and start remembering what I do okay so now that we have that we are going to top it with Colorful veggies. Look at this. Some red bell peppers. I didn't use green because there's enough green in there already. So I used red. And it kind of offset the spice a little bit because the red um, bell peppers are a little sweet. And some cilantro and this yummy, yummy orange, cherry, tomatoes, and green onions. Look at that, look at that, look at that. Oh, uh oh, I love this meal here. And guess what? It's done. Check it out. Peace and love, some big club.